I've been drawing and painting and dancing ever since I can remember. And I think we all have this innate creativity. It's just a matter of truly tapping into it. Probably about 16 years ago or so. And I had this moment and I was it was just me, myself and I and I was painting and I just had this revelation and my higher self tapped in and said, like, this is this is what you're meant to do. I always have to create with music. There's no way around that. And dancing will definitely get me in to that mood. It's a beautiful escape from reality. I do find that my fluid dance movements coincide with the way that I paint. I mean, using, using a paintbrush and putting it to the canvas is a dance in itself. I can speak so much more through dance and painting than I can through words. Yes, yes, that's that's how I speak. I speak through through art, through dance, through movement, through paint, through photography, through any type of creative outlet. That's I think how I best well express myself. As a person with ADHD, it helps me speak in other ways that I find hard to express myself with words. I've finally gotten to a point in my life where I take myself seriously and I have more self-love and respect. So now that I'm on that journey of self-love, I've been able to tap into it more. It would be sad to leave this life knowing that no one ever saw your work. So it's, it's our duty to express ourselves for the world run towards that fear and don't let it have so much power over you because whatever you're worried about, that's not what it's about. It's not about their judgments or what they think. It's about putting yourself out there and speaking through your work and putting your voice out there, not allowing anything that's telling you to stop or whatever silencing you to combat that and find your worth and self-love through uh, through your work. Whoever's telling you, you may feel like it is yourself telling you that you can't do these things or you're not good enough, that that's not you, that's not you. And someone somewhere down the line told you that your work wasn't of value and it's not true. And I think the more you put yourself out there and let yourself be seen, the more you can understand that. It, that's all we have as an artist. That is our voice. And we can't keep letting this world silence us. And the only way to do that is to express yourself through your work and, and through your art.